Galak Z or Galak Z. This one is completely sealed. I just got this one along with two other games I'm about to go through. 2018 Valentine's Day there. Forever Alone Sale, brilliantly named. Uh, that, that's how I pick these up. Not that it matters. But uh, yeah, we've still got the seal on here. And one thing I think is really cool about Indie Box, like these guys know these things are, co are for collectors. A lot of people who get these things don't even want to open up the packaging at all, you know, keep it in mint condition because it's a collector's item. Because of that, they even put a sticker on the top of these that says, uh, don't want to open your box? Use your Steam key that they print right here. So you never even need to open this box at all to play this game. You can just download the game from the code and that's it and keep the box on display. Um, as sacrilegious as it may seem, I'm going to open these boxes because I like the things that are in here and um, otherwise I couldn't make this video. So forgive me. I was going to open them eventually, so whatever. Now I'm using my trusty old uh, box cutter here. Should be good. Oh, and uh, I have played Galaxy a little bit. Um, I remember when I think PlayStation Plus gave this away for free on the PS4 in mid-2017, if I remember correctly, but I played it for a couple hours. Uh, I really enjoyed it. I mean, I'm not gonna talk about the game, but it's, I believe, um, procedurally generated space combat, but that, that's selling it short. And one thing I, I didn't mention yet is, um, you have to read this box. I'm not gonna read it out loud to you, but this box, like every element of it is like written and phrased as the sound like it's straight out of an 80s Saturday morning cartoon, which is hilarious because Galaxy is, is new. You know, this is just came out. It's just a game, but they really do a great job at presenting this whole thing. Like it really was based off of a show from the 80s or 90s. And it, uh, that's just hilarious. You know, it, it just really keeps with the theme of the game, which is you know, a little over the top, a little cartoony, but definitely cool, definitely fun. Um, I plan on playing more of it later, but I did enjoy the few hours I spent with it earlier. So without further ado, let's break into this guy here. So what do we have? All right, I'm trying not to like destroy everything. So many things. All right, where do I start? All right, so I guess we'll just address the elephant in the room here. The figurine that it comes with. Um, I don't know the name of the character. Includes exclusive figures and official soundtrack. All right, so his name is Official Figure. So we've got the base. Got the character itself. And, you know, this thing's about, like, three, four inches high, tall, big. Okay, uh, this stand goes to here. And then he's got a sword that I first must liberate. There we are. Ooh, tight fit. They wanted this thing to stay in. There we are. Little galaxy figure. Definitely cool. Gonna display that guy later. Um, then we have a thing. Oh, a USB thing. Uh, shaped in what I assume is one of the ships. It's kind of got like a very soft rubber, almost feels like a, a pencil eraser, but you know, it's a soft rubber. I assume this guy has the soundtrack on it. Uh, usually, if the soundtrack doesn't come on disc, it'll come on a USB stick. I find I find this to be actually the growing trend. Not sure how I feel about it yet, because I also collect CDs. Go figure. All right, so besides that, uh, we have another clip of sorts, which I'll figure out what that goes to. We got a sticker. The official Indie Box Galaxy Collector's Edition sticker. If you like sticking stickers everywhere. 
And we have this uh, curious little decal. I'm going to assume that maybe it goes in the stand I was talking about. Okay, maybe, and maybe that serves as the backdrop for this guy. Can you see it? There we are. Cool. Um, then besides that, we have... I'm not even sure what this is. <laughs> uh, music from the animated television series, and it's shaped like a cassette tape. Again, they, they put a lot of work into the design here. And I'll be damned, I, I think there is an actual cassette in this. Like, you can't really see, but it's plastic. There, I think there is a cassette. I'm, I'm opening it, but... Like, thank God they gave me the soundtrack on USB, because how am I supposed to listen to it on tape? I mean... I just, I just, I just gotta know for sure if this is actually tape. Wow. Consider me impressed. Where did they even find blank cassettes? They, someone had to make these. Like, they're printed with Galaxy and everything. These aren't like generic gray tapes. If this was made for this package. That's phenomenal. That blows me away. Um, and I know all the the contents of the box are listed on the website, so you know you know you're gonna know what you're getting before you get it. But I like the element of surprise. I barely even looked at what came in it. I just knew I liked the game, and this is odd but cool. Um, I'm I'm not sure if I'm ever gonna listen to the soundtrack on this thing, but I do like that it's included. Let's see, we have a sticker, you know, your basic Galaxy sticker. Cool. Um, this is undoubtedly the manual. Worst case scenario, survival manual. To be open only in the event of a class Epsilon catastrophe. Well, we're not there yet, so. Wow, well, I got it. Manual, what we'd expect. Like I said earlier, full color, well written, you know, this. Love was put into these things. That's that's what I love about indie box. And last up, I'm assuming this guy is a poster. And yeah, we are. Hmm? So that's Galaxy. Uh, yeah. Maybe I'll talk about that game a little bit later in the future. We got Fury down. We got Galaxy down. What is coming up next? We have lovers in a dangerous space time. Hey, thanks for watching to the end of my latest unboxing video. Would you buy this indie box physical release? Do the collectible seem worth it to you? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And please, subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about the next unboxing coming soon.